20 months into the pandemic, many local restaurants still really struggling. In fact, a new survey shows most restaurants are seeing fewer customers in recent months. New at 11 tonight, Jeff Rusak looks into the concerns some owners now have as we move closer to winter. Here at Mooney's on Military, it's a tale we've heard before. People don't understand how, how bad it's getting. On Monday, the restaurant had to close. They simply didn't have enough staff. And according to the owner, Chris McCann, finding people to work remains close to impossible. I had 15 interviews one day, one showed up, and, um, and then the one that showed up, I hired and he didn't show up for his first shift. The New York State Restaurant Association releasing polling results that shows a similar story throughout the state. Of 206 restaurants that were polled, 62% have seen slower business over the past three months. 71% say sales are down from pre-pandemic levels. 78% say they don't have enough staff to keep up with demand. And 92% say their costs are up since before the pandemic. McCann is seeing just this at his Tonawanda sports bar and grill. It's not about making a profit right now. It's about surviving for us. 67% of those restaurants polled don't believe their situation will get any better over the next year. It's only going to get worse before it gets better. McCann says his prices will eventually increase. Uh, but um, I don't think it'll be ever what we call normal again. In the town of Tonawanda, Jeff Rusak, 7 Eyewitness News.